integrated life. So let's chat about integrate. What is an integrated life? So like how most of us live our lives, or at least me, um, I'll speak for me, but I think a lot of people also, um, they live their life in compartments. So there is the compartment that is the, like for a lot of black people I know, we have like the Sunday compartment. Like, so I don't drink on Sunday, I don't smoke on Sunday, I don't curse on Sunday, you know, but on Monday, I stab people and bury them under the garage. Like, that is how a lot of people live their lives. And I know I'm being facetious, but really, that's how a lot of people live their lives. Or I don't, um, I don't do this at work. Um, I'm this way at work and I'm this way at home. So. Um, what happens when you have those different compartments? So we have our work compartment, we have our community or neighborhood compartment, we have our church compartment, we have our family compartment, we have our uh, parented or motherhood compartment. So, you know, I'm a mother and when I'm with my child, I don't dress this way, or I don't do that thing, but when I'm not, I do this thing and I do that thing. So, and none of that's wrong. None of this is wrong. This is not about a make wrong. It's just by, it's just a conversation. It's a plain language conversation about uh, compartmentalization of our lives. And I know for me, for 49 years, that's how I've lived. Um, and one of the things that I'm doing now is this whole project is about integrating my life. It's about being able to be 100% me in every situation. So that doesn't mean that my, you know, that I'm going to behave like I would at a party in the office. Like that doesn't mean that, but what it does mean is that I am that same person in all of those places. So no one's going to see me at the cigar lounge and go, "Oh my god, that is my CPA." Or that is my, you know, like who I am, I am that same person when I'm working, when I'm dealing with you in any environment. I, I am that same person. I'm not putting on the representative per se. Um, and most of my life I did put on the representative. And I will say that um, by changing that, it has created such a freedom. Um, it Not just a freedom in being who I am, but a freedom with time, a freedom with conversation. I can share with people more, um, whereas before I would kind of isolate myself off and kind of shy back from crowds or gatherings or things like that because I felt like I had to be on. Um, and I remember talking to a really, really close friend of mine and I would tell her, you know, she she has tons of events and I mean, they're elaborate, elaborate events, really nice. And a lot of times I just would be absent, you know, noticeably absent from those events. And part of it is just, I would tell her, you know, I just don't feel like being on. And she's like, I don't get that. What do you mean being on? Um, and I didn't get it either. I just knew that I didn't feel like being on. Like I wanted to just be home and be myself or whatever that meant. And um, it wasn't until in the last few years that I realized I am um, I am a representative in certain arenas. And so um, when I would be out in social settings where there might be mixed company, there might be clients and there might be friends and there may be people went to school with, just all kind of mixed in together, I always felt like I had to be on because as if, almost as if there was a part of me that if someone were to see, they go, oh my God, I can't deal with her or I can't talk to her or she does that or she drinks or you know it, it's really interesting and funny because I have a client who I loved as a client couple I love them to death um, and they uh, recently invited me to an event and one of the things over the years um, I've been invited to a ton of events by a ton of clients and whom I love and I don't ever go so if you're one of those this is why, okay? Um, it's not because I don't love you or I don't want to come. It's that I didn't feel like being on. So anyways, um, this couple invited me and 2019 is my year of integration. So the YouTube channel, all of this is about like being fully me, being the artist, being the comedian, being, you know, the funny me, being the serious me, being the the teacher, you know, being all of that in one forum. And that's what this channel is about. And I love it. It's so freeing. But anyway, so they invited me to the maze concert and I like, they have this whole deck and it's really exciting. And, uh, my first thought was, uh, nah, 
not going to go because, you know, my automatic, like, I don't want to be on. I don't want to have to, you know. And so anyway, um, did take her long to sh to share some things with me about how much fun they had before. And I was like, okay, I'm in. So I'm going. I said, but don't judge me when I have a drink, you know, or whatever, you know. And it was kind of a joke, right? But this is a client. So I'm like, she's not ever seen me, like, in that kind of environment. So I need to throw that out. She's like, what? That's what you're supposed to What are you talking about? Like, and so that was really freeing and I'm really looking forward to that. So that's coming up in September. I cannot wait for that event. But yeah, so an integrated life, um, it's just being able to be you in all settings and it doesn't do away with appropriate behavior. It doesn't do away with um, what, you know, dressing as expected or, you know, any of those things, um, you know, you don't wear a bikini to a funeral, things like that. Like, you know, it, it, you know, it doesn't just do away with social norms, but what it does do is it allows you to be who you are in all of those. And so, um, Kidra is who I am. If you notice on my branding and you'll see that on these videos, I've dropped last names because if you know, you know, my last name has changed quite a bit. And so, Hey, I just thought, well, the one name that has stayed consistent um, since I was born is Kidra. So we're just going to go with Kidra. So we are kind of coming out with a whole new rebrand and you'll be seeing a little of that coming out. That's part of um, the integration. And so hopefully you'll go on this journey with me. Thank you. And I challenge you, you know, if, if that's something that you notice that you have a compartmentalized life and you want to step out and begin this journey with me of integration, please share with me in the comment section about what's going on for you. Or if you did that in the past, like, cause I might be late. I'm at 49. Maybe you did it at 29. Share with me. Let me know what, what you did and how it worked and just kind of how you started blending all those different facets together. So love you. Talk to you later. Bye family hi guys thank you so much for joining if you like what you're seeing please let YouTube know you can do that by clicking my photo up above as it floats on or just simply subscribe into the page it's completely free for you and it lets YouTube know that you like what you're seeing also if you like this video hit the thumbs up button um, and give me any feedback in the comments section you can also uh, message me on Messenger, Kedra Flowers, or Facebook, Kedra Flowers. Thank you so much for supporting. Have a blessed day.